Good morning, everyone. It's 1021 AM. It's a Thursday, and I thought I'd bring you along with me today. I have something I'm ashamed of. It's my front porch. I'll take you out there in a moment, but it's actually, that's one of the things on the agenda today is I'm going to take down all my summer decor. It's pretty bad. Everything's pretty much died, and you'll see my Halloween stuff back here. Don't worry, I haven't decorated for Halloween. I still have a project or two I'm working on, and until then, I just I just left it up. It was just easier because I'm going to have that in the background, but um, not a lot going on today. I just want to declutter my front porch. I do want to go to Ikea because I saw that they have some Halloween stuff, and let me show you guys. I'd like to, while I'm at Ikea, at Ikea, I'd like to find some way of organizing the cat litter. Like right now, I'm in my, my room here, and I have this basket, but it just, you know, it just doesn't really do anything. I'd like something with a lid, so I'm going to look to see if they have some sort of a storage solution for me that doesn't look bad. I hope that makes some sense. So I've already got my hair pulled up. I'm in kind of like a grubby outfit. So I'm going to head out to the front porch and take down all that stuff before it gets too hot out. And I know that's really a joke because it's actually already 95 out there according to my thermostat. And my ALEXA device says it's already 92. So we're expecting a, a high of 105 again. <laughs> I know it's typical for summer, but man, I'm so ready for it to cool off just a little bit. I've got a mess back here, and as of filming this, I still haven't shared this with you guys. I went to Costco about a week or two ago, and I picked the, maybe three weeks now, I picked this up, but um, hopefully by the time this video is up, I would have shown that to you guys. I know, that was really random, right? But I was trying to explain the big pile I have back here. Let me just grab my trusty tripod. By the way, I know everyone knows the prices of everything have gone up, but I have to tell you, back in the day, which was not that long ago, I could get these for $1.75, I think it was, or was it $1.50? I don't remember. For around $2, I could get this at Daiso. Then they raised the price, and now you just can't find them. I'm so disappointed because it was such a good buy. And now I think the cheapest I can find it is like, just under four dollars on Timu and look at the side here as you can see that little stinker she loves to scratch it up which is good because I'd rather her scratch that than my furniture I know I talk a lot and I'm sorry I'm rambling but I don't think I've updated you guys I bought one of these off of Timu originally and it didn't work I did have a nice viewer tell me that by plugging it into the actual outlet, that that's why, you know, it may not have been charging. I did try that and it didn't work. So I did repurchase a new one and I love this thing. I have to tell you, it's great. It, it's actually a lot easier than scrubbing yourself because it does the work for you. I mean, you still have to move it around, but man, I love this thing. I, it's great. All right, guys, look at this. <gasps> the ferns <laughs> they're not doing so good i've got to admit it's gotten so hot and so dry i just gave up on them plus the fact that i had birds constantly living in this one fern so nothing i, I think the birds are done with my ferns so i think it's okay to take them down and these items here I'm going to take take out to the back. They're not really doing very well. And I think that they're just tired and hot. Oh, and I have to give you an update. Look, my rosemary bush that I had up here is dead. So I'm going to cut him back. Actually, I'm going to just cut him. And then I'm going to bring in my summer decor because, quite honestly, I'm just tired and ready to put up summer not putting up fall just putting away the summer package i had ordered has, has arrived so i thought i'd open that and show you what i got i'm hoping i like it if not i'll have to return it mm -hmm. 
I bought this bag off of Marshalls.com. It was around, it was $40. So I thought that wasn't bad. And it's, it's real leather. And it's by this company here. It says here the retail value was $158, $159. There we go, $159. This is my old bag. I've actually had it about, gosh, three years now. And I really like it. But the problem I'm having is that, see, I don't put a lot of stuff in there, just like my wallet, a lip balm, my glasses, key fob, coin purse. This is pretty much everything I keep in it. But the problem I have is like, it gets so bulky and fat, like it just feels awkward on me. So I thought, when I found this bag, I thought, oh, that might be good. It's not, I actually like the smaller bag. Let me see if I can, oh. I actually like the smaller version. I don't want anything too big, but this I think might work. I like what I like about it is it has a big flap with the big opening here. And then it has a zippered pocket inside and two slip pockets. But it also has so I can put my phone here. Actually, I'm not even sure my phone would fit in there. It has a slip pocket in the back. And then right here, it has a zippered pouch here. So I would put my wallet and stuff in there. I don't know, it's a little bigger, but not by much, which is just what I want. So we'll see, I'm really attached to this bag, but it'll be nice to have an option for the bigger size. I did pay $40 for it. Can you guys see that okay? And there was $10 in shipping, but I felt like for $50 for an all leather bag, that was a really good price, even with the $10 shipping. In a while it's actually 1201 p.m. right now I'm finally here at Ikea and let's get in there I'm ready for some Swedish meatballs first things first meatballs
the boo mat for $15. And we've also got this mat here for 10. This is what I was looking for. It's too expensive though. Here's the wreath. They don't have it on display. The wreath is $24.99. And for $11.99, they have these lanterns here. Jack-o-lantern lanterns. And it's like a thin nylon, so it's not a fabric, so that's not too bad. They also have this jack-o'-lantern, like neon type light for 13, and they have a ghost as well. Here's what the string lights are supposed to look like, but I haven't found them. They may be out of stock. This is neat, $40. You've got the little stand and the little swinging thing. I happen to know a cat or two that might like to just sit in there and sleep. <laughs> All I have to say is thank goodness for these shortcuts. Let me tell you, <laughs> they're a lifesaver. Alright, I'm trying to find the pillows. I think they're somewhere around here. I found the bat bags for $2.99. Oh, look at this. They've got an air purifier. $40. Whoa. What did I do? Oh. Okay, we're good. We fixed it. How much are the filters? Filters are $10. It's not bad. There's a larger one for 75. I think I've seen that one. Oh wow, is that a table with an air filter? It's okay to change our mind. Oh, I guess they give you 365 days to decide whether you like it. What is this? It is a table with an air purifier. Holy smokes, 269. All right, look what I found. Cute, cute little tea light holders for $3, these little spider shapes. And they've got these here. We've got the mummy, the ghost, and the jack-o'-lantern. How much are those? These are $3.99. And there, they've got the glass in insert with the metal outside. This little guy, he's the cutest. 
Oh, I also found out these are $8.99, the larger ones. I've also got these ghost candle pillars for $3.99. Got plenty of those. I'm back from Ikea. It's actually almost 2.30, and I thought I'd show you what I what I picked up. I I did okay, except I went and splurged on this. Huh, so I did pick up, oh, let me get the light on for you. Here we go, it's a little better. I did pick up four of these chocolate bars. These are my husband's favorite and they're $1.99. So I grabbed those. I did pick up this bag. I, I wasn't thinking I was going to, it was $2.99, but the size of it was perfect, you know, for going to Aldi and whatnot. And actually, I really like the baths on it. So I went ahead and grabbed that. I did go ahead and grab this basket. It actually, you know how you see something and it's everything you've been looking for but haven't been able to find? I went ahead and just grabbed it. Um, it was actually more than I wanted to spend, but I haven't been able to find anything. You know, I've been to the thrift stores and whatnot. And I haven't found anything that was exactly what I wanted. And this was exactly what I wanted. It has the handle, which has a handle, has the lid. I really wanted the lid. And it has, even it even has wheels to it. So let me take the wheels off and I'll show you. So here's what it's supposed to look like. It has wheels with a little stand. So you can wheel it in and out, which is even better i was i honestly i hadn't gone to the website to look for anything like this i did go to the website to check out their halloween and when i got there this was actually quite a surprise so i was actually really happy to see this so it's i think it'll hold my cat litter perfectly it has a liner and it has the wheels so i think i'm going to go ahead and put that together in a minute and it also has this wood base and I think it'll fit perfectly in my room up against the wall and I can bring it in and I should be able to bring it in and out easily when I need to refill the cat litter I picked up two sets two packs of two of these um, these curtain these sheer curtains they're like the ones I currently have in my room it's just now I'm gonna have them all the same curtain where before it was kind of a mixed match and that's because this little stinker and her nails they scratch up everything and I did pick up the, the Halloween tree it was $20 I probably could have found it cheaper elsewhere however I really liked the style that they had of the branches I thought that was pretty unique because most most of these trees they all have like the same look the just the regular branchy look let me show you what I mean do you see how the branches have like this little like the little look to them where most of the trees you've seen, they just have like the branches that are, they're the wiry look like this. I actually really like that about this tree. It looked more like an authentic spooky tree to me. I've already put some lights in there. I'm not sure if it has a timer. The instructions don't say if it has a timer or not. You know, we all know how the Ikea instructions are. But I'll have to let you know in about six hours if they turn off on their own or not. Typically, Ikea stuff does come with a timer, but we'll see. It took three AA batteries. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and take down the shears. You see these here? These are the ones I'm going to take down. And I, are, I, have two, I have a pair of these already, and I'm going to add... I guess I didn't need two pairs, but I'm gonna add, I'm gonna go ahead and add the two pairs. I really like it when it looks all full. I feel like it gives it more um, privacy. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now. But a little somebody is asleep down there. Gidget. Oh, 
there she is. Hi. Look at all that dust. That's not good for your asthma, baby. Come on. We got to get these curtains picked up. We're going to put some clean ones on. Come on. So I'm going to quickly do this and hopefully get my basket together. I should be editing a video right now, but I have been putting that off. I don't know what my problem is. I just, oh, just sitting down and looking at myself on video all day just isn't fun for me. <laughs> Wait, what am I saying? And my husband's actually just texted me. He wants to go to a movie tonight. It's not a movie I want to see, but I do like to go to the movies. So, so that means I have to put the meat in the fridge again because I was defrosting it for dinner but that's also a good thing because then that means I don't have to cook tonight yay so let me get this done and I'll let you know how it looks when I'm done what are you doing are you helping are you helping we have to wash these they're dirty all right all done looks really good now that they're all the same I think these are so pretty. I, there was $15 for the pair. These over here, I have one more, I have two more pairs actually. I need to wash them. And then this, this set here, I think I need to get rid of because it's got a lot of, um, a lot of scratch marks from her. Can you see that where she's scratched? Oh my gosh, look at her. She's already, hello. You like it in there? She's so funny. I just vacuumed so it's all clean. But she loves to be back there. Crazy girl. Okay, I am going to get the wheels finally put on this thing. Whoa. And get the cat litter inside. I am currently dreaming of cooler weather and fall. So I found this live stream. Who's it by? by Virtuescapes. It's called Farmhouse Porch Autumn Night Ambiance. So uh, that'll be in the background. Okay, I've got it set up here. I decided to take the cat litter out and to dump it. That way it's easier to scoop than if I had it in the bag inside here. So it's here for now until I can clear this off and maybe move this this way and have the back against it here. So if I don't want it here, I can eventually move it.